Hi guys, welcome back to Garage Tech. In this video, I'm just going to do a bit of a comparison between the Iridium Tough spark plug compared to the Iridium Power spark plug. So both of these are manufactured by Denso. Uh, some of the spark plugs they make are to OEM standards. But what I want to show you today is just the difference between the Tough and the uh, Power version. So I've got two here. These are both for the same application. Um, and as you can see, the numbers on them. So these are the two spark plugs. We have the VKH22, which is the Iridium Tough. And then we have the uh, IKH22, which the, is the Iridium Power. So the main difference between the two is with the Iridium uh, Tough, you actually have a platinum uh, finishing on the end. So just inside here, you can see inside the tip there. There's a bit of platinum. And that's what gives this uh, tip of the spark plug the uh, extra life. Uh, if, you, if I compare that now to uh, the Iridium Power, you can see at the top there is a slight difference. I'll try and keep these both together so you can see. So on the Iridium Power, it's got a tapered cut on the end. It doesn't have the uh, platinum bit on the inside of the actual tip. But what it's actually got inside there, if you can see, is what they call the U-cut. You can just about see that there. So that helps the uh, what they call the quenching. So when the actual flame starts. So if we're talking about life then, uh, the Iridium Tough, um, they are rated for up to 100,000 kilometers or around about 62,000 miles. So obviously this sort of spark plug is gonna last a, a long time. Um, whereas the Iridium Power, they're only rated between 15 to 20,000 kilometers. So that's around about um, 10,000 miles. So you really wouldn't wanna go uh, any further than that with these ones or certainly you want to be pulling them out at that point and uh, checking them. Now in terms of the actual price, um, the Iridium Tufts are slightly more expensive. Now I picked these ones up for £12 a spark plug, whereas the Iridium Power, uh, this was uh, about £7.50 a spark plug. So you can see there is a slight bit of a uh, price difference. It's been £12, this £7, but actually if you think uh, price per mile, then obviously the Iridium um, Tough is um, a lot more value for money. But what you get as an advantage with the Iridium and Power is that you just get a slightly better uh, kind of sparking um, for your combustion. So that helps with the uh, efficiency, emissions, etc. cetera. Um, now testing them side by side, general road use, you're probably not gonna find, there's, you're not gonna really notice any difference at all uh, in general driving between the two. Um, and I suppose really it's up to uh, your own kind of um, specification that you want to go for or up to your own uh, desires. Now for me, I'm going to go with the Iridium Power um, because the spark plugs are actually relatively quite straightforward and easy to uh, change on my car. So I'm not too worried about it. What you do find though is on some cars, uh, the spark plugs are hidden underneath inlet manifolds, etc. So it takes uh, quite a lot of work just to get to the spark plugs. And it's not the sort of thing you wanna be doing, uh, certainly on a yearly basis. Whereas actually if you can get to them relatively easy and you can get, get them out, then uh, I'll, I'd probably recommend the power ones. Just to give you that a little bit of uh, that extra bit of an advantage. Um, but between the two, I mean, obviously they're both great uh, spark plugs. Denso are well re renowned for making spark plugs, etc. Uh, obviously it's Japanese, so the quality is um, superb. But um, that's a look at the difference between the two. So I'll just show you those again. Let me just get the camera into focus. Now obviously the tips of them, so the bits right inside in the, what's called the electrode, they are made of uh, iridium, or so an iridium alloy. Uh, which Denso use, it's not pure iridium, they use a, an iridium alloy um, because they say that um, saves a bit of wear. Um, also you can see the ceramic is slightly different uh, between the two as well. 
with the Powell looking like it's slightly thicker compared to the uh, Tough. In terms of weight, they both weigh exactly the same. It's 50 grams. I've weighed them uh, previous to this, um, just out of interest, because actually I thought that the um, Tough kind of felt like it weighed more, but actually I weighed it and they were the same. So it was a bit, bit of a surprise. Um, but generally, obviously, you can see the top, it's got the um, ceramic at the top. And it uses uh, a nickel finish in the, in the end. Okay, that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. As always, if you have any comments or recommendations, leave them in the comments section below. Give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Okay, that's it, guys. Take care.